Yes, that's true. I just learned C plus plus in just three days. And where did this idea came from? To just learn in three days, and how can you do it? So here the job started. It all began after surviving all the competitive exams in 2021, when I had a lot of free time. At first, I watched a bunch of movies and web series because I don't want my friends to make fun of me for not watching the latest movies and web series. One more thing, Elon Musk inspires me a lot, and I came to know that he just learned the basics of C in just three days when he was at the age of ten. At that time, I decided to take on a challenge to learn C in just three days. The only problem was as a bio student. I didn't know what programming was, so I did a bit of research, and I watched C intro videos of a YouTube channel known as CS15, uh, taught by a Harvard professor known as David. And let me tell you, these lectures were so good. If you are new to the programming, you should definitely watch it. You will get an idea what programming is. Later on, I switched to code with Harry and watched some ten videos before realizing that C++ was a better option. So I switched to the C++ lecture of Code with Harry. So it has a playlist of 74 videos. So to complete in three days, I have to watch at least 24 videos a day. Challenge accepted. Day one, I was feeling super motivated, and I watched the videos at two x like a flash. And I worked ten hours and took notes. Uh, and finally, I completed 23 videos. I was on fire. Day two, my motivation was reduced a bit, but still I started, and I came to know about Apna College YouTube channel, and I watched some five to six videos, but I came to know that it's not beginner friendly, so I again switched back to the Code with Harry, and at the two x I watched some eighteen videos, and I still had a half a day. When I realized that he was giving too many examples in his videos, so I decided to read instead of watching. So I downloaded an app from the Play Store, and uh, it has an accurate content about the C language and every notes in it. So I just went through it. I just made notes when it's necessary, and at the end of the day, I just finished learning from that app. So sometimes documentation is better. Day three, still 33 videos were remaining, but actually I got an idea from reading from that app. So this time I just saw the code. I just see the examples, then I skip the part where he was repeating. So this literally saved a ton of time. And at the end of the day, I just completed the playlist. Mistakes. Number one, resources. At the starting, I don't know what to do, where to learn from. So I wasted a much of time from. Switching this YouTube channel to this YouTube channel, I didn't know what to do. C or C plus plus. So choose one and watch two to three intro videos. Understand what coding is, and then start reading, like documentation. And don't read the boring documentations. There are good ones like that app. So you can use that, and then later you can complete the playlist, and that will be like a revision for you. And make notes. That's important. Number two, revision. After completing, I didn't revise anything. There was, there was almost a one month gap before revising, and it took a lot of time than what I expected. So do revision, otherwise you'll forget everything. So don't be like me. Revise. So how was the video? If you found it interesting, then like and share with your friends and with those who are a beginner. And this applies for all the languages. You can do it for C plus plus, Python. If you're learning any other language, you can do it easily. See you in the next video. Bye bye.